So if I walk away, she follows tentatively. If I walk towards her, she walks away. If I squat down, so that's her line. It's a lot of fear. But if I turn away and walk and squat down, now I'm going to kind of pull her to me. Yeah, she's actually approaching on her own. My back is still turned to her. This is new. She would not get that close to me before. So this is a lot of the fear that we're dealing with. She's watching my hand. Again, I'm not facing her. Now, the pr my hand moving down is pressure. So I'm just going to put my hand here. See how she does. Usually, this is what she does. She'll lie down. She doesn't want me to touch her. Or she's nervous about me touching her. So I'm not going to. Her reward for coming close and for not and for handling this is my not touching her. I'm not going to push her past what she's comfortable with. As soon as she quits shivering, she shivers when I talk, so I'm going to have to stop talking here a second. As soon as she quits shivering, I'm actually going to get up and move away. That's going to be a big reward for her. I'm moving away. She's taking off. She's following. We're de dealing with quite a bit of fear right now. So we're taking small steps. 